Suzanne. Yes. What day is it? Summerween. It's Summerween. <laughs> what are we doing? We are celebrating Summerween. We're going to make some cookies and later ice cream. All right. What's special about these cookies? They have tea in them. All right. I have none of the ingredients out, so I can't show <laughs> <laughs> This is a recipe for shortbread cookies that I got off of Instagram from a an Adagio fan, actually. Uh, so they, thank you, Nameless Adagio. So thank you. <laughs> I forget who it is. Um, but thank you so much. Uh, I really appreciate it. I've made it with Earl Grey Bella Luna, and mm -hmm. it was delicious. So good. So, so hopefully it'll be good with this tea that we're trying. To yes, we are trying it with Suzanne's blend. It's an All Hallows tea blend mm -hmm. for summer ween. Um, and it's, we're going to see how it is, but I'm sure it's going to be delicious. Yes. Okay. Wait, it says who it's from. Oh, here we go. Uh, Lady Sincere. Lady Sincere on Instagram posted this recipe for shortbread cookies. Thank you, Lady Sincere. We sincerely thank you. Lady. <laughs> okay, so for this recipe, we need one and a half cups flour, a half teaspoon of baking powder, uh, some salt, some butter, which is, um, we need sugar, we need an egg, and then we need tea. So. All three basic ingredients and the tea. And the tea. Cool. Step one is to cream the sh sugar and the butter. The butter should be softened. Oh my gosh. That is a three fourth cup. Boom. You know what? Sometimes it's just better to get in there and do it with your hands, Jeff. If you ever worked a day in your life, you just take your hands <laughs> and you just start squeezing. I'm so offended right now. Good. <laughs> so after we've creamed the butter and sugar with a spoon, we add one egg, which I'm terrible at, so you should probably just stop filming now. Yay. You did it. So now we are taking all the dry ingredients. We got flour, baking powder, and some salt to taste. So I don't use too much salt. That's probably good. And the tea. We're combining it in a separate bowl. After we mix them all, we're going to add it to the other concoction we made. A little bit at a time. Ooh, nice dinner. Sure. I feel like this is a terrible idea. <laughs> it's all mixed now. We're going to split it into two logs, essentially, and then we're going to wrap them up and freeze them in our freezer for half hour. Good so now we get to slice them into little slices. Um, it didn't say how thick they need to be, so it's an adventure. You get to choose your own. I'm slicing it with the plastic on now. Maybe. I just realized that's like a tiny oven. It is a small oven. It's a tiny house. I might just speed up all this part anyway. Okay. Now we gotta let him cool. No, you just put it right in your mouth. We'll do their extra gooey. We're gonna try the cookies. They um, are shortbread cookies and they've got a mix of pumpkin spice, chocolate chip, and almond. This is one of Suzanne's Halloween blends and um, it's really good. She also has this one. It's hard to see and the artwork's a little beat up, but- It's a little scratched. It's a little scratched. But uh, it's good, I promise. All right, ready? Everyone have a cookie? It's really satisfying. <laughs> it's nice and sweet mm -hmm. from the cookie, but what's really nice is it takes on the flavors of the of tea. Of whatever tea you put in it. So if this one has a little bit of pumpkin spice, 
chocolate chip and almond. That's the tea flavors. Um, and I think it's got some cocoa nibs. Yeah, so it's got a little bit of chocolatey nibs to it. So. And it's even got some orange peel in there, mm -hmm. which is completely okay to put in the tea and eat. At least none of us have died yet. So far. <laughs> so far. We're trying, though. How many cookies until we die? Probably about two more. Probably. <laughs> so, uh, what's the name of this tea, Suzanne? Uh, Jack o' Lantern's gr Grin? I think so. Something like that. It's part of my All Hallows Tea collections. So. Her characters for the All Hallows Tea blends have backstories and they're really cool and she said there might be two more this year hopefully fingers crossed so check them out and also this recipe is delicious thank you again lady sincere for yes. posting it on instagram we sincerely thank you lady i think we've had um Susie, you tried two different blends of tea i've done it with the earl grey bella luna which is my favorite um definitely check it out and if you love cookies it's pretty simple and just super delicious. Very, very good. You can impress everyone. Don't sneeze on our food. We use this much. <laughs> Don't spill it. Then we throw some over our shoulder to get in the eyes of the devil. Uh... Oh, that's, that's eight, eight seconds. seconds. <laughs> All right, we're going to try the cookies that we made. <laughs> that was like in my face. <laughs>